This is Meridian Tonight, and these are the headlines here in the southeast. Royal seal of approval for the invention that's saving millions of lives across the world. Now, as inventions go, it's uh, pretty simple, yet it's already saved an estimated two and a half million lives worldwide. And today, Mark Koska from Sussex won royal approval for his uh, revolutionary design of syringe. It's already revolutionising healthcare worldwide because it can only be used once. That means it prevents the spread of AIDS and other life-threatening diseases because needles can't be reused. Today, the Princess Royal visited the Sussex firm to present the Queen's Award for Enterprise, as Malcolm Shaw now reports. At his makeshift surgery in Delhi, a doctor shows the one syringe he's using to inject all his patients, a lethal but widespread practice in the third world, and one which causes more than a million deaths every year by spreading infections like HIV. Children as young as five are paid a pittance to scour rubbish tips for discarded syringes so they can be reused an average of seven times. It was this global health problem which led Mark Koska from Sussex to invent his revolutionary star syringe that can only ever be used once. This is how the syringe works. You use the plunger to pull it out and fill it full of vaccine in the normal way. You then administer the injection. But try and pull the plunger out again a second time and it simply breaks off, preventing the syringe ever being used again. So it is a real pleasure to have the opportunity uh, to give you your award and to congratulate you and thank you on behalf of an awful lot of children, never mind other people, for what you have created. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Today, the Princess Royal visited the headquarters of Star Syringe at Pippingford in Sussex to present the firm with the Queen's Award for Enterprise. Obviously a huge pat on the back for the team but um, what is very important is that it's a, a great base for us to work from now. We're allowed to put this uh, Queen's Award logo on every syringe that we make and we're making two million a day now. So to be able to uh, pump out that sort of British inventiveness, British success story around the world is very important to us. It's estimated the star syringes have already saved two and a half million lives. They're now being manufactured by licensed factories across the world. Mark's design was the, a simple and easy design to manufacture. It's simple and easy to train and uh, it's really excellent. It took Mark Koska 20 years to get his syringe off the drawing board and into production, but now his life-saving design has won royal approval and changed when the face the of global health care forever. Malcolm Shaw like this, for Meridian Tonight. All you do is squeeze. Terrific stuff, eh? Clever idea. Great stuff.